Today we will be talking about scavenger receptors, part of the innate immune system. The innate immune system, which we are born with, is the first line defense against foreign invaders and uses the physical barriers of our body, such as our skin and the chemicals in our blood, to protect us from harmful disease-causing organisms that are known as pathogens when they breach our body's barriers and cause disease. The cell players of the innate immune system defend the body against foreign invaders like bacteria by recognizing, responding to, and destroying these pathogens to prevent an all-over infection. Scavenger receptors are found on the surface of these innate immune response players, like macrophages, that utilize the process of phagocytosis. This process is similar to how a Pac-Man eats the little neon dots in front of it. Scavenger receptors can be described as molecular flypaper in our bodies because their function is to recognize and bind a ligand, aka a molecule floating around in the body that will fit the receptor similar to how a key fits into a lock. When the scavenger receptor recognizes a PAMP or pathogen-associated molecular pattern on the surface of a foreign molecule, it binds and signals the macrophage or other immune cell to begin phagocytosis of the pathogen. A PAMP is simply a name tag or ID differentiating the foreign molecule from other molecules. Once the pathogen has been engulfed by the macrophage, a lysosome, similar to a garbage disposal, comes to destroy the pathogen. The lysosome releases chemicals into the macrophage that breaks down and destroys the pathogen to keep it from increasing infection. Now that we've explained how scavenger receptors play an important role in the body's innate immune response, let's compare them to toll-like receptors. Toll-like receptors, or TLRs for short, are another important class of receptors found on the membranes of many innate immune cells. Like scavenger receptors, TLRs recognize PAMPs to signal an immune response. Unlike scavenger receptors, TLRs not only signal phagocytosis, but also activate a signal cascade of cytokines, which are chemical molecules that tell the rest of the body there is an infection present. Another difference is that scavenger receptors are involved in the defense against bacteria only, whereas TLRs are involved in the defense of bacteria, viruses, fungi, and parasites. The biggest difference, however, is that scavenger receptors not only play a large role in the innate immune response, but are also critical to lipid metabolism as they bind to LDL, which is known as bad cholesterol. Finally, scavenger receptors can either function on their own or they can work as co-receptors to TLRs in order to increase the efficiency of immune response. We hope you have a better understanding of scavenger receptors and their role in innate immunity, as well as how crucial they are to fighting off infections in our body daily. Thanks for watching.